The college system here at York is a way of turning a big university of 18,000 students into several smaller communities. It means that you're part of a, a smaller, supportive, inclusive community. What we do in essentially is support students, so you've got a wellbeing team um, and staff in college at all times. We also run activities and events. And your college isn't just about where you live if you live on campus, it's part of the community that you join. We like to sort of say it's a home from home, in a way. Mature students have the same access as all the students do to our staff, our wellbeing services, our facilities. Mature students tend to live off campus, although not exclusively, and so they find a lot of use for things like lockers, communal kitchens that they can access, common rooms, study spaces, places to go between lectures. They all have a common space where they have a kettle and a microwave, which means you can make a cup of tea between lectures without having to go and spend a lot of money. Most colleges will have representation for mature students. Uh, most colleges will have a committee. So to begin with, you can get involved in that and get yourself elected to it. For you, if you've got ideas, take it to your college reps. Go to the JCR and tell them what you'd like to have within um, university. Don't feel afraid to go up and speak to somebody and tell them what's missing or what you'd like to see. And the college system is, for a lot of people, the first point of contact for non-academic issues that come up. So there's a whole range of welfare support within the college, um, ranging from our student mentors that each student will have. You can talk about any problems at university, anything you want. You can ask them about um, activities that you're interested in societies so we're here to provide support and they also as college tutors help um, students find what they need to be as successful as possible. Every college is run by an elected committee but that's not the only way to get involved. The best way to get involved with your college is to make sure that you read your emails. You'll get lots of them sent out to you but it's really important that you read them so you get to keep up to date on all the different events that are happening. There'll also be posters delivered to flats and college tutors will be popping in to tell you about it. Check the social media for your college as well. They all have a Facebook page and lots of events are publicised on there, particularly during Freshers' Week. I do understand, having been a mature student myself at one stage in my life, one can be working full time or have families or be travelling into university. It can sometimes feel like you have less of that connection. Please do reach out to us, share your ideas, you will be very welcome in the college community. The sports competitions last all the way through the year and anyone is welcome when you join university and it's so much fun and you can try things out. If you're living on campus, you'll be choosing your college when you choose your accommodation. So choose the accommodation that fits in your price band that you think you'll be happiest in. If you don't live on campus, as many mature students don't, you can take your time picking your college. Check out the website, check out the social media and come and talk to us. There's something for everybody and it's just up to you to try something and um, hopefully make lots of friends. <laughs>